the University of Texas is a major research institution. It's also a great teaching institution. And because of those two great roles that a university plays, the Ransom Center is key. It is, it is at a crucial nexus with the university. It is part of it, it is central to it, because it enables the university and the humanities to do two things of great importance. One, to conduct research among its scholars, its students, and among the world at large. The other role is a teaching role, which is very much a part of the university. It gives our students, the Ransom Center does, an opportunity unlike many places in the world, where they can come and look at original manuscripts, they can study, they can learn from them. They can feel and touch manuscripts, touch the last final draft, the final drafts of Ulysses, for example. They can uh, read and understand how the artist crafted time after time to get it right famous uh, closing of uh, the novel Farewell to Arms that Hemingway wrote. Twenty-nine times he wrote that uh, ending just to get it right. When John Ford directed that film, he said, why do we keep shooting this? Why do we keep shooting this? And he said, because Hemingway took so much time to get it right. I want to get it right. I think when a student can see these drafts of a manuscript, he or she can recognize the craft the inspiration, the way in which the imagination operates, to see what was left out, what was put in. This is one of the great opportunities that you have at the Ransom Center. We have a wide range of things that we study here, but I think some of the most interesting are those very works that are the cornerstones of our culture. You can go to the Ransom Center as a student and see Matisse's Jazz, the great book of the 20th century, for example. You can go to the Ransom Center and see the very first editions of Shakespeare. Uh, you can go to the Ransom Center, and if you're studying a course in John Milton, you can look at Milton's Lycidas, the first edition, where Milton himself made those changes, five of them in that text. These are the kinds of things that bring the excitement and, and the love of literature to, the, to us.